Hi there everyone, it's Sarah here. I hope you're having a great Saturday. I'm here sharing the goodies that I bought last Saturday when I attended a stamp board workshop with Yvonne Carruthers through at Stampers Grove in Edinburgh. Um, it was a fabulous class. Um, I had no idea what stamp board was. So I bought some, but I'll just show you the goodies that I did get. Um, first of all, I'll rewind and I'll show you what I did at the class. So this is stamp board. It's just kind of like an MDF type board, but it's got a clay coating on the top and you can scratch bits away. So you, it takes colour well and you can stamp on it and you can do all sorts with it. So that was the first one. That's an ATC size. So I did another two in the ATC size. This one was just using distress inks in the background and so was this one. And that's just one of these little cheeky bird things that Tim Holtz has got out. I bought that stamp set last week. And then this was using alcohol inks. Now I quite like that effect. Um, so that was, and that was a paper artsy stamp. But I also did a mini one. Um, and this is in a 2x2 two two square. And what I did was I sat and scratched that one out last night. Um, because I've been ill last week with the flu, so I, had, I haven't been up in my shed. Um, so that was that one. So what I also did was I bought two packs of the stamp board. And this is it here. And I bought the assorted squares. And you're getting a right good assortment of 2 by 2s and 1 by ones Must be one. No, that must be three by three. No, that's two by two. What size is that one then? This must be one. Oh, it's one and a half by one and a half, and then one inch by one inch. So that's your three sizes. And uh, I'm going to have a little play around with these this weekend and see what I can do. Um, they're fun to work with. Um, I just think it's great. It's just something different for me to try. So they were eight ninety nine, and you're getting a fair amount of pieces in there. Um, and then I got, I also got the ATC party pack, and these are nine ninety nine. And oh, there's a wee chap in here as well. I must have done another one and a half by one and a half for one of these wee birds. But I used, there's embossing powder, clear embossing powder sealing this one in. I don't know if you can see that or not. And I also used um, the Dazzle Versa mark um, to for the embossing powder to stick to. So it's got a little bit of shine underneath. And then I scratched the eyes out to get the white stamp board underneath. Um, and I also did a little bit of scratching on the black. I don't know if you can see that or not back a wee bit so I also scratched out some of the black so that was that and that was my ATC size ones so to go with that I also bought the scraper set and you're getting five pens with interchangeable um, scratchy nibs and they do different um, they do different things so I've yet to play with them all so that was the other thing that I got. And then alcohol inks. I picked up some alcohol inks because I want to have a little go. Um, so I've not used these yet. And this is the Tuscan Garden set where you're getting oregano, um, red pepper, and I'm not sure what that middle one is. Let's see if I can turn it around. Ah, mushroom. So that's quite good. So I'll have a little shot of those. And that was my alcohol inks to go with the rest of the stuff that I bought. And the other thing that I got was this Paper Artsy stamp set. I thought that would be great for the stamp board. And this bit here is what I made this one with. And I think this one will look great as well. So can't wait to play and have more fun. And then what else did I get? I picked up another one of the small talk 
um, Tim Holtz wordy things, self adhesive words. So I quite like that. And then I just got a collage glue stick, and this is the. Is this a Ranger one? Yeah, it is. The Ranger collage glue stick. Some Stardust stickles. See, as it's coming into Christmas soon, and I don't have any stickles because I threw them all out because they were all they were all done. And then a little heart punch from Woodware, and it's just a little cute thing little dinky heart. So that was my haul from my craft workshop that I did last Saturday. And uh, Oh, I've got one more thing to show you. Um, I ordered this a while back and I lost it. I had no idea where it was in the house. Um, and I had a good old tidy up and I found it. So it's a mama elephant die set and it is the... what one is this now? Oh, it doesn't say, but it's kind of like the sewing one with the stitched borders, if you can see that. So I can have a wee shot of playing with that. And the other thing that I got was a waffle flower die, and it's a little tag top die that cuts out a wee, a wee polo for going onto the tags. So there we go. That's, um, that's definitely everything that I've got this week. I'd forgotten about that one. And, uh, and I'll see you all soon um, and I hope to have a good replay this weekend and make some things so catch you later, bye for now